Guys, I'm with Manny Koshman in his incredible man cave, and I'm going to show him some watches that'll just blow him away. I'm making a prediction. There's a godfather oh in God. Manny's future. It's gone crazy. They're trading at one and a half, 1.6, 1.7 million dollars. That's crazy. Dollars. So you can just hit it up and scratch it. You know. Oh, come on. Is that sick? Oh my God. Look my the, favorite song. So I hope you saw on Manny's channel some of the watches that we, uh, that we showed you when we were talking about investments. I'm going to show a few more now that Manny hasn't seen, you guys haven't seen. You ready? Yeah, I know you saved the best for your channel, so I, I'm excited to see I what saved, you got there. Save some good ones. Yeah. <laughs> All right, we're going to start with something really, really crazy. Really crazy. This is oh, wow. the Jacob Godfather. What? So it's a triple axis tourbillon. Mm -hmm. This guy here, do you know what a tourbillon is? Oh, I know it's like a movement. The Some complicated engine. thing, right? Yeah, it's very Ex complicated. Exactly. So you know about as much as I do about yeah. watches. Right? <laughs> so, but this is very cool. So it's a Godfather. Is that a piano in there? It's a piano. It's barrels, and this is a violin. What? So let me show wow. you this. This is how you wind it. You pull this out, and you wind oh, the violin. Oh my God! Is that crazy? Wow! Right. So now we put that away. How do they get I all know. these detail in there? That's crazy. Are you ready for this? Yes. Oh, come on. Is that sick? Oh my God, my the, favorite song. Look at the huh. barrels turning. Wow. They're actually playing the piano wow. keys. Hold that on. is crazy. Isn't that insane? That is crazy. Wow. So yeah, check that out. And it's so light. It is light, it's, it's DLC. It's actually white oh, gold wow. and DLC. Oh, sorry, rose gold and DLC. And how many of these I made, 88? Uh, is this 5588? Your eyes are better than mine. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Well, I better take off my patik first. We don't want to scratch this watch because I don't even want to know how much you paid for this watch. Isn't, this it, is, isn't it spectacular? Oh. So light. Isn't it cool? That looks good, Manny. Now, it's, oh my it's God. big, but it, it's not uncomfortable, is it? It's super comfortable. Right. Like, I can just picture myself as smoking a fat cigar and playing the Godfather music <laughs> and driving my Bugatti or a Rolls. I'm making a prediction. There's a Godfather oh in God. Manny's future. Yeah. <laughs> is that sick or This what? is insane. So tell me, how much does this watch retail it, it, for? It's, it's actually, I, I don't want to say not that bad, but it's, yeah. it's in comparison to some of them. This is just under $400,000. Hmm. But it not also that. comes in yeah. different variants. You can get it with a diamond case. Uh, yeah, platinum. This is the the DLC model, but it's it's uh, amazing. Pretty pretty cool. Amazing, it? amazing. I mean, it's piece of yeah. art, really. Total you know? piece of art. And, right? and you know, who doesn't love Godfather? So I think and again, they've done the, a pretty good creative design with it. Yeah, the entire center turns again like the Astronomia. So it's amazing. It's quite quite something. Oh, why do I have yeah. a feeling that's not your most expensive watch you're going to show me today? Well, the most expensive one is this one that we oh, looked right. at in the 1. other video. Oh, that's right, $1.5 million. Yeah, or, or higher. Wow. Uh, so we haven't actually spoken about this on our channel, Michael. So why don't you just let the audience know what the deal is with this? Why is this Rolex Daytona the most expensive watch you have now? I don't know. Uh, <laughs> so some phenomena, uh, this watch is 180,000, 185,000 MSRP. Uh, they didn't make that many of them. And now it's just blown up. It's gone crazy. They're trading at one and a half, 1.6, 1.7 million crazy. dollars. That's yeah. crazy. Yeah. Well, you know, the, I saw the Tiffany one is selling for like, what is it, five, six million dollars? Yes, yeah. Stainless steel. And it's what's the $30,000 watch. Oh my God. Don't, yeah. <sighs> I'm going to throw it's, up. It's really I, crazy. And I, was, I, and I thought do, I was making good investments. Do you want to know? know the funny thing? Yeah. When I bought this watch, everybody said to me, you're stupid, you're going to lose your brains. No one will ever buy this watch if you want to sell it. Yeah. Look at it now. <laughs> and how long yeah. ago was that, just so I know? Five years, maybe. Wow. Great investment. Yeah, amazing investment. Yeah. Uh, well, what's I, crazy is like with that Tiffany dial that you were talking about, even the Rolex date just that you have, with the blue dial, it's not even Tiffany, it's just the blue dial. That's gone up that's too. That's gone up. Yes. Yeah. 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 All of them have. Yeah. Uh, it's, it's, I nearly brought that today. Uh, stainless steel watch, $5,000, they're selling for 30000 Wow. Why? Who knows? But of right. course, there are brands that are not doing as well. So you're, yeah. you're pretty choosy who you, you know. So you the, the, this, this watch here, this is, yeah. a, I think, $60,000 list. Mm. Um, this particular watch, you could probably buy now for $35,000, $40,000. Really? So it went down. 
on wow. the secondary market. So you then buy a second one. No, yeah. I didn't buy a second one, but I bought this watch because I love it. Yeah, of course. Uh, I didn't buy Some it. watches you buy because you're just passionate about the yeah. this story, history, to, and to, design. To be, yeah. to be fair, yeah. I buy all of my watches because I love them. Uh, it's a bonus, of course, if they're going to go up in value. Sure. Coincidentally, the That's watches... That's the right attitude. Right? Yeah. But coincidentally, the watches I like are the ones that do go up in yeah. value. I mean, they're heritage brands. I'm going to show you something else crazy. So this one here... Is that another Jacob? It is. Ah. It is. Yeah. I can tell because Jacob watches are bulky because they put so much into the movement and I'm winding art this and again detail. with the crank. Ah! Very cool, right? Uh, wow. This is the... What is it? Twin from? Turbo Furious. It's a double, triple axis tourbillon. I love how they're so easy to put on and they're so light. Right? And it's also a minute repeater. Wow. So if I slide this up, mm -hmm. it will play you the time. Look at that. So those are the hours. Can you guys hear it? And now the minutes will come. Oh, that is cool. So it plays hours, so it quarter hours, and then minutes, yeah. so you know exactly what time it is. Very cool. Isn't and that special? Yeah, and I like how it's rugged. You know, the band yes. is rugged, so you can just hit it up and scratch it. You know, do <laughs> please, <that>. please <laughs> don't. <laughs> Very cool. And they all have a translucent back, so you yes. can see all the movements. And how many of these do they make? Are these like... You know, I don't know the answer to that either, but if... Yeah. It might say so on the back, and I'll trust your eyes. The guy more has than so mine. many watches; he doesn't know production numbers on each. I don't know well, production numbers. Yeah. I don't know where buttons are in cars. <laughs> yeah. I don't know how anything ever works. Well, these are even too uh, small of a font for my eyes. But I yeah, I'm sure it's super. <laughs> I, I'm sure it's super limited. But so, how much this retails for? Uh, these are about four hundred thousand. Four hundred. Yeah. Wow. So, Another SLR I could buy. Right. So the, these are the equivalent of supercars, yeah. really. And uh, like supercars, they go up in value. And, and, and again, like I say, yeah. this, I would never have thought it, but it's crazy. I mean, it's really, yeah. really crazy. So I tell anybody, if you've got some spare money, buy a watch. Buy the right watch. Mm -hmm. Buy a watch. Oh, yeah, yeah, all saying is, hey, if you need money, it's a Rolex, Rolex on your wrest. You yeah. can just yeah, cash yeah. it in. It's, a, it's always liquid. And That's I've got one last one, which I have. Sh oh, no, I haven't shown this on the channel. Uh, you know, I, I showed it in, in Manny's video, but let's yeah, talk about Yeah, that was my favorite, let's, to be honest with you. Let's talk about it. Yeah. So this is the Richard Meal 11, uh, RM11, and it's the Lotus edition, which is a limited edition. And again, mm. uh, your eyes will probably be able to see that. My Lotus car, uh, Cars? Lotus Cars, yeah. You bought something from Lotus? Lotus stands for lots no of way. trouble, usually serious. <laughs> Well, well, you know, uh, McLaren and Senna, when I bought my Senna, they offered me the watch. But back then, I didn't know. Oh, you should have bought that one. Yeah, it was, was 200 some thousand. That's it was 200 some thousand. Now you're selling for like five, six hundred thousand, right? More. No. And more, yeah. Similar to this, right? Same, same watch. Yeah. yeah. Same watch. Yeah. What a shame. Yeah. Um, uh, that's one regret when it comes to watch buying. I should have bought that. But, wow, but you never so know, light, right? So light. So light. But pretty, isn't it? Very pretty. This is his lotus at the top. And I like the carbon fiber forged uh, frame and the gold and the red. It's, it's just a really nice, yes, very nice combo. Very nice combo. And this sells for, what was the retail on this one? 130, 140,000 was the, yeah, the MSRP. The, the MSRP, and now these are about 600,000. 600,000. Yeah. Wow. And I don't know why. I just, I just don't know why, because Richard Mille is a new brand. It's a relatively, relatively new, brand. new, yeah. And you know, with the heritage brand, Patek, Rolex, yeah. I get it. Yeah. But, but Richard Mille, they've done phenomenal marketing, and everybody who's anybody's wearing them. Yeah. So. Well, um, I love the white one uh, that I've seen. Is it called Baba or Buba? Baba Watson. Oh, Baba Watson. Yeah, yeah, yeah Baba yeah. Watson. Yeah, the yeah. tennis player. So, what is that like? MSRP. Um, I think they were about a hundred and twenty. Uh huh. But they're now. Probably 300. 300. Close to 300. That's 000. not that bad. I can't afford that. Yeah, if you say it fast, you don't feel it. <laughs> wow, these are extraordinary well, watches. And I got one last one, which I'll show you. Um, this is uh, a GMT. Ooh. It's white gold, it's very heavy. This looks vintage. Uh, it's actually from 2009. Mm. And uh, this is a full factory case. Everything on here is from the factory. You had oh. to bring that, didn't you? It's your favorite you watch. You had to bring that. Yeah, Adam's I love that favorite watch. watch. Yeah, this is really nice, and it's solid white gold. Yeah, right? you can feel it, right? Wow. Yeah. 
He taunts me with it, Manny. <laughs> so, so this watch again is Look another one of those watches. I bought wow. this watch at MSRP, uh, and at the time I think this was about one hundred and thirty-five thousand. Mm -hmm. uh, this is close to four hundred thousand dollars now. Wow, wow, isn't that crazy? You know, to be honest with you, you know, it's uh, I'm getting used to it. There you go. <laughs> well, let me see. We can do a swap. I'll take the P one. <laughs> Well, you're not going to go far with my cars because mm -hmm. almost all my cars have barely any gas in it. Oh, well, 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 then no I'm deal. I'm always low on gas. Yes. Let I me see your watch, watch real quick. Oh, yeah. Let me, see, let me take a look at my needs. Mine's so boring compared to everything you've shown There's me. There's nothing boring about this watch. This is a beautiful 5980. Uh, absolutely gorgeous watch and another great investment. Yes. You paid, what, 65 grand for it? Uh, 67. 67. And yeah. now two, two and a quarter? No. Yeah, I would think oh. so. Okay, you have your checkbook? No. <laughs> I'm just I, kidding. I do. <laughs> no, no. I was, I, yeah, I, so Patek uh, and Rolex, I'm told those two top brands are like the, probably the best uh, in watchmaking, right? In terms yes. of investments, right? Yes. And yes. the legacy behind it. Yes. Well, so pa I, I have Patek to, is probably one of the oldest brands out there. Really? And uh, yeah, it's just always carried the name of the finest. Yeah. So Useful. basically you say never sell it, keep it. Oh, it depends how much someone offers you. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> As they say, everything's for sale at a price. Yeah, right? everything's for sale except my wife and kids. <laughs> but no, I love this watch because, you know, it's kind of It's classic. understated. Yeah, yeah. Understated. And, and you know, you can wear it with a suit, you can wear it casual. It's kind it's of flexible. It's light, it doesn't weigh It's you. light, yeah. And people that know watches, they're always like, oh, nice watch. Right. I get a lot of compliments on it. Right. But, but listen, no, this was fantastic. Unbelievable. Thank you so much. Make sure you subscribe to Manny's channel. And, and make sure uh, you guys subscribe to his channel. But we're all, we're, we are on his channel right Well, now. some of them don't subscribe, so that was a good message. <laughs> we're Thank in you. it to win it. Invest wisely. Hit the like button. Hit the subscribe button. Anything else? Nope. Well, if you want to know about investment in cars, check my channel. Definitely. <laughs> we'll see you.